On Drover's TV, the UN meeting this week in New York held a special session to address what members call the biggest threat to modern medicine, antibiotic resistance. The UN estimates more than 700,000 people die each year due to drug-resistant infections, although there is no global system to monitor such deaths. All 193 UN member states were set to sign a declaration to work toward eliminating the overuse of antibiotics, including the use of antibiotics in food animals. They've also pledged to develop new business models that improve access to vaccines and new antibiotics. Last week, pharmaceutical manufacturer Elanco said it's aiming to develop 21 new alternatives to animal antibiotics. The company has introduced six so far, including vaccines for poultry and enzymes for dairy cows that strengthen their immune systems. This week, Elanco is hosting a summit in Washington with about 50 executives from meat and dairy companies to discuss responsible antibiotic use. Henderson says pharmaceutical companies aren't the only ones under scrutiny. Experts believe livestock producers also will be charged with reducing their use of antimicrobial drugs, including changing animal handling and production systems to help reduce the threat of disease, thereby reducing the use of antibiotics.